Group 13, we're the capable wheelchair, as you can see. Basically, we're going to take this wheelchair and make it capable of having voice command, automated movement, via following a line that's being drawn or is going to be implemented on the floor, depending on the user. And it's also going to have a tilt feature to help the patient get in and out of the wheelchair at the same time. It's also going to be able to manual control and autonomous control via a switch. If you're coming here and we're basically going to be talking about what's going to be happening in the future on during, during the summer and going into fall. So basically, I'm going to be dealing with mostly the programming part. We're focusing more on the voice command feature that's going to be on the capable wheelchair. My name is Peter DeGroote and I'll be working with the wiring of all the electronics, so including the microcontrollers and the sensors. And I'll also be working partially with the programming. I'm Matthew Formosa and I'm going to be responsible for the autonomous feature of the uh, capable wheelchair, as well as the sensors. Okay. We're going to demonstrate the tilt feature at a closer angle so you can see the demonstration of how it works. Right now we're going to show off the wheelchair. As you can see the railing goes forward and the top tilts for the seat to come off, the patient to come off the front of the wheelchair. Now if we say back to original position or back on seat as you can see the railing goes back and the base adjusts to the level height where the seat is supposed to go now we're going to show the movements of the wheelchair Ricky Mejia will be controlling the joystick for the manual movements which is forward back Turn backwards diagonal at an angle. That's a 180 degrees turn. Go forward. It's going slow due to the joystick has a feature called uh, speed control, which adjusts the amount of voltage being sent to the motors at a given time. If they're switched to the side, they're inactive. You can freely move the wheelchair and the controls will not work. The only controls that will work at this time are the railings, the system to get off and on the wheelchair. But this is to provide easy movement to park the wheelchair without any batteries or if the batteries run out at a given point.